How can you get Forge in Minecraft 1.20.2? Well, in this video, we're going to show you exactly how to get Forge every single step. First things first, you're going to need to download Forge, and there's a link in the description down below, the second link down below, and it will take you here. Once you're here, what you want to do is scroll down and click the download button. But this is actually our complete text guide to Forge, and I want to mention some things about this article. Specifically, if you do prefer a text guide, we have a guide on getting Forge in text format. But the most important part of this is the troubleshooting and FAQ section. For example, if you're having issues with Xcode 1 or exit code zero whenever you're trying to launch forge let's go ahead and click on exit code one here and here are the potential issues and ways to troubleshoot both of these errors here depending on which one you're getting nevertheless though once you're on this website you want to scroll down and click download forge here and that will take you to forge's official download page on this page you want to go ahead and make sure 1.20.2 is selected on the left hand side and once you see mc 1.20.2 here you are good to come under download latest and click on installer while forge is downloading have a message from our company simple game hosting go to the first link in the description down below the breakdown.xyz slash sgh to start your very own minecraft server running forge forge mods all of that stuff can be set up on your server and play minecraft mods with your friends we also have one click installation of mod packs you can have plugins to your server if you want and if you did just want to host a vanilla server i'm guessing that's not the case since this is a forge video you can do that as well at simple game hosting we've also got expert live chat support and a high quality help center to help you out with any issues you may have along the way and the goal overall is just to make minecraft hosting as simple as possible so go check out simple game hosting at the first link in the description down below the breakdown xyz slash sgh Start your Minecraft server the simple way. As you can see, Forge is downloaded here. You may need to keep or save the file depending on your browser, and it's 100% safe to do that as long as Forge is in the title. Nevertheless, let's go ahead and get installed. So the first thing you want to do is minimize your browser, and then we want to find the Forge file we downloaded. That's most likely going to be in your downloads folder. So go there, and you want to move Forge to your desktop just because it's easier to manage and get this installed there. It's not going to stay there for long. Once Forge is on your desktop, go ahead and right-click on it, click on Open With, click Java, and click OK. But Nick, I don't have Java. Well, if you don't have Java here, what you want to do is go to the description down below and download Java 17. Java 17 is required for Minecraft mods, and obviously Forge is modifying Minecraft, so we need Java 17. And so we have this in-depth guide on getting it. It, like our Forge guide, has troubleshooting issues. It covers everything you'll need to know to get Java installed. You may also need to run the jar fix here. And what the jar fix is going to do is take all the jar files on your computer and link them back to Java, making them work happily together. Obviously, both of these are linked in the description down below. And if you do need to run the jar fix, make sure you get Java first, then run the jar fix. Nevertheless, let's go ahead and minimize our browser and get Forge installed. To do that, right click on it, click on open with, click Java, and click OK. That's going to open up the mod system installer for Forge here, where all you've got to do to install Forge is click install client and click OK. Now, there's not really many reasons this would fail, but if it did, it's most likely because you have Minecraft or the Minecraft launcher open. Make sure both of those are closed. And if they are and it's still not working, it's because you've not played Minecraft 1.20.2 before. Just go play Minecraft 1.20.2. 1.20.2 with no mods or anything like that just minecraft 1.20.2 vanilla close out of it come back and reinstall forge and it will work but nevertheless as you can see it's finishing up now and we have successfully installed client profile forge for 1.20.2 awesome click ok and it will close out of that and we can delete forge from our desktop now let's go ahead and open up the minecraft launcher here and you should have a forge installation ready to go 99% of the time, that's going to be the case. But for some of you, you won't have it, or it won't be the 1.20.2 version of Forge. In either of those cases, the solution is the same. So as you can see, we have Forge here. It worked. We can click the drop down box and select it if you don't have it selected automatically. Click play, click play again. But if Forge isn't here, come over to the top and click installations. Then make sure modded is checked. As you can see, if we deselect modded, Forge is gone. If we select mod it again, it reappears. But if you still don't have Forge here, or if you don't have the 1.20.2 version of Forge, what you want to do is click on New Installation. You can name this wherever you want, but of course, I'm going to name it Simple Game Hosting, because that is the easiest way to start your very own Minecraft server with mods, mod packs, anything you want. Then go ahead and click on the version drop down box here, and what we want to do is select at least 1.20.2 Forge. Right here it is for us. Go ahead and select that. You may need to scroll down on this list to find yours, by the way. Ours is just at the top currently. Then you want to select your resolution you don't have to i'm just doing that so you can see better once we get in game and then click create and now we have this new simplegamehosting.com profile that most importantly has 1.20.2 dash forge under it that's the version we want hover over this click play and click play again and now minecraft is going to open with forge at this point you can install mods you are good to go 
But how do you do that? How do you install mods? Well, we have an in-depth guide in the description down below on how to do exactly that. It's for 1.20, but the process is the same in 1.20.2, and it shows you how to download and install mods on Minecraft for PC, like Biomes of Plenty here. Look how awesome that mod looks. Or Journey Map. Look how awesome that mod looks up in the top right, adding in a mini map. We've also got a guide in the description on how to fix broken Minecraft mods, which is super helpful if you have any issues that aren't answered on our website back here with these frequently asked questions questions and troubleshooting issues. This is 20 minutes of me just basically fixing different potential issues with Minecraft mods. Give it a watch because even if you don't have an issue now, you may in the future and this may have a solution for you. Nevertheless, let's go ahead and see that Minecraft is open. As you can see, Forge is currently in beta. No issues there. And then click on mods and we can see this is where we would go to see our mods once they are added. Nevertheless, if you have any questions, let us know in the comment section down below. Give this video a thumbs up and enjoy modding Minecraft. It's one of the best ways to experience Minecraft, in my opinion. We'll see you in the next one. Peace.